Hey, hey there. Hello guys. It's been a while since my last video. There's been a lot of changes in the tank. So uh yeah, a lot of changes in the tank, a lot of things going on. Uh so today I'm gonna make this video. My last video I think it was uh yeah, high uh phosphorus and nitrous on the reef tank, right? So if you guys remember, I didn't have any uh, nitrates levels up because my uh, nitrate, my nitrates were uh, undetectable. So you know, did a lot of research and everything, and so so far, uh, high, having uh, low nitrates is not good for corals because they need to uh, some of that. So I got. Uh, I got this. It's called uh, potassium nitrate, PKNO3. So this stuff basically is uh, adding nitrogen to your tank. But you guys need to be careful when you guys. Uh, those in this actually I uh it's another reefer on YouTube so Amaral Azul I think it is I don't know if I did it pronounce it right so I uh, he was uh dosing nitrous potassium to his tank because uh he also have undetectable nitrates and uh he uh, ranked it up to I think 0, 0 0.5 right so this is how it looks okay so what I did was uh, I added let's see what's my measurement cup yeah so I added two of these which is uh, one quarter uh, a teaspoon to my tank and that take me up on my nitrous levels between like two days I tested to 0 0.25 so yeah that was uh, that was a lot nitrous high nitrous in, in two days so yeah, you gotta be careful with that stuff. So uh, I mean, I uh, nothing really, really bad happened, but uh, you know, I mean, that was a drastically change in my nitrates. So and I still have the, uh, as you can see, the biopellar reactor, which I want to take the thing off, but. I'm gonna take it out, but not yet. So, um, it's running, it's still running there. Let's, uh, let's see if I can turn this on. Well, that's the refugium, I still have the refugium there. Keto, Cheeto, whatever you want to call it. So, that was probably like a month and a half ago. So uh, this is my all my stuff that I use. Okay, so for nitrates I use the Salivert test kit. It's really easy to use. It's very easy. So last time I. I checked my nitrates were yeah right there 0 0.5 0 0.5 then my nitrates right now so I haven't done any water change yet but um, I don't think I need it 
but I was on my uh, with my guy, the one that I go and get my uh, RODI and you know my my fish and everything. So I was there a couple of days ago, and he told me to do you know even have my uh, alkalinity, calcium levels are good and my nitrous are good. I still I should make I, I should do a water change, you know, at least ten percent, you know, every two weeks. Because, uh, you know, it's, uh, he said that I should do it, you know, just in case, because sometimes things can get wrong and really fast, so it's better if I take some of the water out. So I'm going to do that probably um, Thursday. Okay. So anyways, this video was uh, about this stuff potassium nitrate so if someone getting that trouble on undetectable nitrates so just be careful when you dose that okay so probably next time if I run into zero I instead of two of this probably we use one or half of it and then test in like three more days to see how you, uh, your levels at all right. Do you guys have any questions, comments? Uh, please let me know. So, also, I don't know. You guys notice I, my rocks, my aquascape is different now because uh, I got those. So this, that one is an acro. Another acro there. So. Basically, I want to this half of my tank to here. Got some monkeys there, they're growing. So, I want to do this half, it's an SPS, and this half is my uh, my LPS, my soft corals. So, there it is, and I got some new fish. Cardinals. Everybody seems happy. We got a new light. Okay, so I'm gonna make another video about my lighting, about the lights, pars. So, uh, Yep. So right now I got pockets here because I wanna do maintenance on my extra pump. It was making a little weird noise. So I'm gonna take it out and uh run it into some uh, vinegar, clean it up. I did that with a skimmer probably like two months ago. It's running good. You guys can see that. So yeah, if you guys uh, have any questions or comments, just let me know. I will make more videos. And please, uh, again, thanks to uh, all those guys out there, all the reefers. We got to put some valuable information out there to help everybody, you know, so we can learn and uh, do some things in our tanks. Alright guys, so this is it for today, so um, thanks, comment, subscribe, anything you guys want to put there, You're very welcome. Thanks so much for watching guys, talk to you soon, bye bye.